gravity. Um, and this is what we see in front of us. This is Newton's law of universal gravitation. Now, we're, basically what happened is we started with Aristotle. And Aristotle had the idea that everything sought in its natural place. Um, and basically what happened is through the years that we, we get Newton. And Newton um, had the idea that he could take what applied on Earth and apply it to basically um, terrestrial, or we're talking about we're talking about planets, we're talking about big, larger things. And basically what happened is we came up with Newton's Law of Universal Gravitation. Now, it wasn't later um, until we got this value right here, uh, G, which we it is our universal gravitational constant. Um, and this was found by Cavendish. Um, and he gave us that number, that G there, which is 6.67 times 10 to the negative 11th Newtons meter squared over kilogram squared. Um, and basically what we have is we have this formula that uh, helps us determine everything about gravity. Now, th with gravity, everything that is involved in gravity, everything else, everything exerts a gravitational force upon each other. So I exert a gravitational force on the computer, you, upon the walls, and everything exerts a gravitational force. Um, if it has a mass, it exerts a gravitational force. There has to be two things. We see that we have M1 and M2. This is mass one and mass two. So there has to be two things for there to be a force. And then we see we have this distance squared. Masses are in kilograms, distances in meters, um, and then our universal gravitational constant we have there.